He's got a mid-90s fastball and a great slider, great changeup, and he has the ability to get quick strikeouts. Zeal's 1-2 delivery. It's softly, and a nice play behind the bag at second base. J.D. Urso takes a base hit away. J.C. Navarro digs in. First ball swinging. Lifts this one in the air, first base side. Torres in foul territory says he has it, and he does. And that's a quick 1-2-3 inning. Then it's on base percentage and whip. That's down low for ball four. Cuvé is going to run, and the throw is well late. He had that. He was off and running. Into center field. Wade on the run to his left, and he makes the play with Surrett in behind him. That one hung up there. Lines that one into right field for a base hit. Fielding in one hop by Surrett. He smoked that one. It's an opposite field single. Taking big leads, especially the guys that aren't looking normal base stealers. Chopper towards short. It's gloved, and there'll be no play. The smothery it was for Renzi. And that's going to get pitchers in trouble. That one's a call strike three on the inside corner. J.D. Urso goes down looking as Yawn strikes him out. Since the start of this program, they know how to pitch. And the left field, the Angus can't get there. It's over his head and up against the wall on one hop. And Navarro racing into second. It's going to be close. And he's in there with a double. Dorian Gonzalez wants to look at it, but it's a double off the wall for Navarro. Dorian Gonzalez flopping that tag down there. And, oh, boy, that's close. I think he might have got him. I mean, that, that front foot comes up off the bag. Safe. One ball, two strikes, and the pitch from Zeal. Lined in the center field. It's going to fall in for a base hit. And here comes Navarro around third. He's going to be held up as Long's throw is cut off right around the mound as a shark. One of them last weekend. This one softly hit center field. Charging in. Long makes the catch on the run. And the runners will not be able to advance. Jack Power from Northampton, Massachusetts. Waiting on the 2-1. Lines this one into right field for a base hit and maybe more. One run in. Racing the third is Harper. Play's going to be at second base, and he's going to be out at second base. Power thrown out a second, trying to stretch a single into a double, and that limits the damage. Gonzalez lashes this one into right field. It's in there. A diving attempt by Surrett Gonzalez. Had it for a second, and he's in there safely. Good effort by Surrett in right field. Into right field, backing up is Surrett, and that one is gone! Home run for Torres! An opposite field home run. He takes it over the right field wall and gives Miami the lead 2-1 to one here in the fourth inning. And Torres continues to sting balls all season so far. But you can see right there, Yawn, you saw in an earlier at bat with Lorenzo Carrier making that pitch, that fastball up around the letters, hitting his spot. Right there, he drops it a little bit, doesn't hit his spot, and Torres right on it and deposits it in the right field. The Hurricanes come right back. And you can see catchers asking for it up. He just misses right down the middle and Torres and keep this lead. High fly ball, center field, Jacoby Long backing up, still backing up to the warning track, reaches up, and he makes the play in center field, straight away center field. Jacoby Long hits the fence and holds on to the baseball and makes a whale of a play. J.D. Urso does a good job behind the count and works a walk. He finds his way into the lineup and has done a great job for them. Runner is going on a swing and a miss, and the throw down to second is going to be in plenty of time. J.D. Urso is caught stealing to Costello. And that's ball four. He walks him on four straight. I'm not sure if I should point this out or not, but that, that cookie monster sitting there right behind home plate. He's been there about the whole game. If that doesn't make you want yeah. cookies, I don't know what will. Cave wraps this one on the ground into left field for a base hit. Stopping at second base. Is Costello. Miami has runners at first and second. 
Carrier takes that one for ball four. Three straight Miami hitters have reached now. Strike three called right down the middle. Gonzalez takes a third strike with the bases loaded. Miami strands Costello, Cube, and Carrier. 3 2 pitch from Zeal. Low ball four. One out base runner. Ball two, strike two in the air to right field. Backing up Costello. Backing up, and that one is gone. It's a home run. Navarro, a double, and now a two run homer. Puts Long Island in front, three to two. A home run to right field. Yeah, Navarro showing his power to both sides of the field now. Getting the double in his last at bat to left, and now opposite field to right field just drops down and gets after that pitch right there. And Costello runs out of room pretty quickly. This one nearly takes Gay Zeal in the center field. Yeah, and I feel like. Swing and it was oh, quick to the first. Job. They've got him hung up between first and second. Torres to Urso and the tag by Zeal, and that's all for Long Island. Has not allowed a hit. He's throwing 19 pitches, 15 for strikes. Cuve drives this one into center field. Wade backing up. That one's off the wall. Cuve into second. He's not going to stop there. He's headed for third. The throw will be cut off, and it's a two-out triple for the freshman. Carrier waits. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Drop the ball. Have to make the play at first base, and they do. Carrier strikes out. And Hurricane Strand, another base runner. Pretty good numbers. 1-1 <laughs> one, in the air, right field. Carrier on the move. Reaches up and makes the play. What a catch by Costello, I should say. Costello, what a play in right field. Van Doren walks Gonzalez. Miami has the leadoff man and the tying run aboard. Line in the left field. In there for a base hit and stopping at second is Gonzalez. Mastillo, oh, the throw gets away at third. Here comes Gonzalez. He's at third base and down to second goes Torres. Mastillo at first in left field. Andrew played it safely, played it on one hop. That's the pitch you want to take into the outfield. Gutierrez takes the 3 2, low and inside. Now the bases are loaded. 3 1, the pitch on the way. Off the fist and popped them up. Shallow right field. It's going to fall in for a base hit. Ball game is tied. Falls in over the outstretched glove of Noah Sorensen. Just couldn't catch up to it. Nothing and two to Kulikowski. Latkowski deals. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Kulikowski swings and strikes out. Letkowski, who looks away and brings it home. Lined up the middle for a base hit. One run in. Here comes Gutierrez around third. The throw is cut off. He scores standing up. Villegas drives in two. Driving it right back up, almost hitting RJ in the head right there, knocking him down on the floor. But just a great job of hitting right there, staying within himself and driving it right back up the middle, driving in two runs and putting Miami up five to three. Costello with a sharp single in the center field. Here comes Long around third. He'll score standing up. Six to three, Miami. Lucas Costello with an RBI single to center field. Singled in the fifth and tripled in the seventh. And it's this one, the deep right field. Surrett backing up, and that one is long gone. Home run to right field for Daniel Covey. And Miami's broken this one wide open. It's a three-run homer. Villegas and Costello score in front of the freshman. Covey homers for the third time this season. Miami nine and Long Island three. Yeah, and it's not easy to keep your batting average up when you're hitting 588, but three for four tonight continues to move that average up. And you talk about not trying to do too much. I mean, he put a he put a lot of power into that one, into right field, and 
Now all three home runs tonight have been into right field, opposite field. I was just about to say, I feel like a home run is coming. Miami will send nine to the plate now. Now another pitching change for Long Island. They were the ninth seed in the tournament. Swing and a miss. Down goes Navarro. Bounding ball, Gonzalez to his left. Loves and throws, and nicely done, two down. First and second to second and third with no outs in. Ground ball, Jimenez at short. Cross the diamond in time, and down goes Long Island in order, one, two, three fashion, and Miami has their fourth win of the season.